having the ability to look at a very complex problem like cancer and having the confidence that it too can be conquered is where it all starts. I'm a medical oncologist. We're, I think we're born with a lot of optimism. Is it overwhelming? Absolutely. I feel a little bit at times like I'm going to swim into the ocean. <laughs> uh, but you got to start somewhere. This is a good place to start. Well, first of all, we're the Ohio State University. We have 18 colleges here. And I am like a kid in the candy store as the director of the Comprehensive Cancer Center because I can go to any one of those colleges, about 13 of them have cancer researchers in them. We all have one goal, and that is a cancer-free world. And we're all working towards that goal every day. The problem is huge, so we need to really bring in the strengths of different groups to make this work and to really learn something. And so that requires uh, sharing. And that's how you create scientific synergy. That's how you really win in science. The National Cancer Institute assembles a team to come to your center and they look under the hood and then they give you a grade and that grade can be anywhere from satisfactory to good to very good to excellent to outstanding and in rare cases exceptional and in fact the Ohio State University Comprehensive Cancer Center and our James Cancer Hospital Solof Research Institute we got an exceptional. Ohio State is known as being a group of investigators that are very interactive that's not typical of cancer research we believe that's going to be typical of the future and I think we're definitely in the front of team research. And we've had some incredible breakthroughs that are really helping push back that beast we call cancer. It's really exciting. Cancer, the Emperor of All Maladies, starts Monday, March 30th at 9, only on WOSU.